When we go about creating context, we also get a provider that's accessed the same way as the consumer component. But unlike the consumer component, it does not take a function as children. Let's use property access syntax again to grab the provider off name context. Again, opening and closing tags. You'll notice something interesting happened. We're no longer getting our default value. And that's because the default value is only given to consumers that aren't wrapped in a corresponding provider. Where providers are used, we're required to give an explicit value prop. Here, I'll use my name. And everything works beautifully. In review, name context gives us a provider. And every provider requires a value prop. That value prop is going to be used in the consumer's function as children, which provides the value that we can use inside of the React element that we return. So creating, consuming, and providing context are the three parts of React context.